Okay. I'm gonna have to pay one of my valuable DCs to attack, which is kind of good. Bad, bad. All right, you could use the building, right? Yeah, you could use this. And are we gonna end? Or are we gonna throw away our Shana? Let's throw away the Shana. See if you could get me something more nice, like more bench Pokemons. That's not a bench. Where are my Rattatas? Did I not put Rattatas in? All right, righteous beating. That is two sh two shot potential. It's still confused. We have one of these, unfortunately. And we're gonna go and use Black Ray GX. Black Ray, knock out that Lele and soft up the God Award for the future turn. So that means I might be able to get a KO with this. Yeah, I just did 200 damage worth of damage. Oh, there we go, Acerola. Acerola is coming out to get me. Well, hello, Oracles and the Frenchels. It's Donald. Welcome back to my kitchen. And on today's menu, I'll be serving you the best GX card in the entire Shining Legends expansion. This is Zora Art GX, and it's dominating in Japan right now because one, its ability makes any deck consistent. Yeah, it's good in a certain psychic deck. It's good in Mega oh, Gardevoir GX, and it's probably good in many, many, many others. Not only that. It can fight. It can fight using very little energies. You get a lot of good value out of this. So, this time I'm not gonna use it in, you know, another deck. I will. Especially when the Entei comes in. I will use it with Entei, but now this is just a Zora GX. You're the star of your own deck, at least for the very first video. So, I'm gonna explain to you how the Zora GX deck works. You're gonna see it in three. Three what? Oh yeah, three. Awesome matches. Yeah, let's get started. Today's intro is Limit Break X Survivor from Dragon Ball Super. I'm all on top of that this uh, this afternoon. Goku, you beat that dry. Okay, okay. Moving on. Just, uh, let's move on. Zorark, let's talk about you. You're stage 1 GX, meaning you have to evolve from a Zorua first, but you get a very good bonus. Your hit points is 210. Above average of basic GX hit points. And a basic GX has about 180 hit points like Necrozma, 170 like Coconut Master. Why is this good? Because these days there are a lot of cards that can one shot a basic GX. Droplet, for example, is everywhere with Garbodor. If you use Berserk, oh yeah, 150 damage with a choice band 180. One shots this, one shots Coconut Master, one shots Necrozma, but does not one shot Zorark. That is a very Big bonus. Okay, moving on. The ability is one of its biggest defining trait right now. So the ability makes your deck more consistent. It gives you extra card draw. Once during turn, you can trash a card that you don't need, that you want to draw again, and uh, you get to draw two more cards. So it's kind of like the catchets from uh, Skyrim. Uh, Catchet has wares. If you have coin, you have to pay up something. To get the wares from your deck, so something must get discarded, which can be good. Like, hey, I don't want a bridge anymore. Yeah, I already filled up my bench already. I don't need Bridget. Trash it. Get two more cards that you may be able to use. And it thins your deck out too. So if you something gets in the way, nope, you won't draw that trash Bridget again. Bridget, you're not trash, but we just talk about the end of the game, you know. So don't don't take it that way. All right, moving on. That's this is good. You put this in two of these into your decks. You have them up. You're gonna have a lot of nice card pulls. If you use it with Mallow, oh god. The combo, you can get two of anything. It's like a super computer search. What Mallow does is look for your two look for two cards. Any two cards, put them right on the top of your deck. Now, what draws those two cards? Sora Arc. Anything you want. You want a DCE? You want uh you want another supporter for next turn? Uh you want anything. Something to reshuffle your cards back. Anything. That's why it's so good. So we we use one mallow just you know for fun. I think we're gonna add more in the future. And so that is that. That is a great ability. And if you didn't have just a great hit points, a great ability, you have a great attack too. So just like the catches of Skyrims, if you have friends, it they'll sell you damage. I don't think that's how it's go, man. But Riot is beating for every Pokemon you have on the field, including Zorar. So at least it will do 20 damage. If you have a full bench, 120. For two energies, this is a two shot on itself in every card we talk about. Two hit KO, one double colors energy, or two energies, whichever you like. Easy to do, easy, any energies. And what's better than that? 
if you are using double colorless energy, you can use a Sorola. Uh, if, you, if it survives, just hit a Sorola, pick everything up, and just promote another Zorark up. It only takes one double colorless energy, so you can flip your Zorarks all day. All day, so... Yeah, they won't die. Everything about this card is good. Even if, if, even if uh, you don't use your GX, which let's take a look at GX, Trickster GX. Choose one of your opponent's attack, which, wherever it is. As long as it's on the field, you can GX, whatever it is, you can use it. So, that kind of depends if they have a good GX attack or not. Yeah, if you're using copying uh, this GX, no, no, you wouldn't use Tapu of gear. You don't have to pay the energy cost to use it, though. So, if they have a really strong, like a Mega Mewtwo, Sorry, Mewtwo GX, something big. Then yeah, it's great. But often, yeah, even if you were playing a dark deck, you may not even do it. So, all right. So we're gonna choose a good GX that happens to be a better Necrozma GX. Now Necrozma actually has to have the energy to do this, and it's only here for its great, fantastic GX, Black Ray GX. And this is I'm not a catch. I'm not selling you anything. However, I will wreck every single GX Pokemon as I see 100 damage to all of them. Why is that big? If this is 100 damage, and this is 100 damage, and this is 100 damage, Zoroark will be lethal in the final attack. So once that goes off, all your attacks will one finish them off. All of them. So Zoroark is beating. Yeah, now I can see. All right, you will see how big that GX is in the in the future first game. So, anything else you want to talk about? I think I spent too long. Uh, yeah. So we're gonna quickly go through Zorark. Why are you here, baby Zorark? You can have a free retreat. You can jump into the active anytime. And if you have a float stone, just retreat back. Send the right Pokemon out. Yeah, free retreat aspect. And you just need a DC, and you even do more damage to the current Zorark. The more bench Pokemon they have, the more damage you do, up to 160. Give it a choice man right here, 100. And 90. One-shotting any GX Pokemon. So by the way, choice man can be used on this, so you can really do 150 damage. Yeah, so, oh, too bad Skyfield isn't here in standard. Anyways, alright, so what else I decide, you know, you know, I need a wingman. And you don't cost any energy to use, Batman is here, just give him a tool, 60 damage. Free, free, and Ashle does 90 damage if you give it a choice ban, and if Zorark follow-ups after that, it's pretty much lethal. If they both had choice ban, that's 90 and 150, yeah, that's 240. So we are, these two are just to open up, Zorak's to follow up, and that is the deck. Alright, Donald, I think we understand now. Alright, I had to go a little bit longer because this is a big, very good GX. Moving on, we're going to go for the first match, here we go. First, uh, Zora Arc GX match, and we're going against fairies. Something as easy one shots. They have all resistance against my deck. The Pokemon's pretty dead on. It's putting something, uh, putting something nasty for me. All right, I'm gonna play my remix of the Alola Trial from Pokemon Sun and Moon. Now, unfortunately, I did not start off with a draw support or a Lele. I'm gonna draw a support. You have four Sycamores, four ends, two Shanas. I think that may be enough. Ooh. Good setup. So, we really do not want our Necrozma to get a... We want to wait for the G Gardevoir to show up first before I use my GX. And if... Yeah, and if he sets this up... Oh, oh, missed. Okay. Draw supporter. Waiting for that. Waiting for that. And thank you for that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm stuck, Bill Cool. Bill Cool, you're cool. Uh, all right, first first Pokemon, come on, come on. There we go, there we go, Zoruas. All right, gonna go ahead and start beating up this Necrozma. So, Necrozma gonna get away from here. Yep, 80 damage, almost two shot potential already. So that that, that kind of stings. All right, you know we could uh, we could do something about that. Uh, do I want a Sycamore? Do I want a Shana? Let's go ahead and Sycamore. Let's go ahead and Sycamore. I don't trust that. All right, oh dear, we actually have supporter. We might have too many supporters. We might have too many supporters, so you know what? I will go ahead and retreat. I'm gonna go ahead and use my Moonless Madness. You're now confused. So oh, you have a half chance to survive, but I gotta go quickly and fill up my bench. Ah, yeah, what happened? What's what the hell? What's with this? All right, we're gonna wait up and see how this goes. So, is your Zora is uh we if if the first guard will come up, it might be actually good to use the GX right now. Field blowers, like, oh yeah.
Alexander Harper, just subscribe. Sorry for not being being around, and uh, oh man, you don't have to. I know you're busy, Alex. And everyone's got their own life to live. So, thank you very much. It's good to uh, good to have you around for such a long time, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so, all right, man. I gotta get back into this horror. Thank you, Alex. Woo! All right. So, oh, yeah, there was a rare candy. There was a rare candy here, so it might be Rimray. So he's having trouble set up himself. Will he attack? I mean, he will get the KO if he attacks. That would so I would that I would take the risk. I would take the risk, but that's the most only way to keep me alive in this match. All right, come become your big Gardevoir GX. Ah, maybe I should get a Vol Lola Vulpix too, instead of uh, one the Krasma. Might be better. Maybe, maybe. So we're waiting to set up. Everybody having trouble, a little bit of trouble setting up right now. Uh, Floatstone! I think I don't want a second more this time. I kind of need Guzma. I already destroyed a uh, Acerola. Tails! It, yeah, you live! Yes! Yes! Zora Arc GX! Oh, you can, you're can. you up to battle. You're up for battle right away. Great! Great! Let's go ahead and do this. That's a lot of Floatstones! I'm sure you don't need those Floatstones. So let's go ahead and remove those right there. That seems like I'm going to get decent value out of that. I could use Riot Beat, but I think I'm going to end first. Here we go, let's go ahead and end, see if we can get more bench Pokemon down, or like a Bridget, or just more bench Pokemon down. You know, more bench Pokemon down like that, that's better, and oh boy. I'm gonna have to pay one of my valuable DCs to attack, which is kind of good, bad, bad. Alright, you could use the ability, right? Yeah, you could use this. And are we gonna end, or are we gonna throw away our Shana? Let's throw away the Shana. See if you could get me something more nice, like more bench Pokemons. That's not a bench, where are my Rattatas? Did I not put Rattatas in? All right, righteous beating. That is two sh two shot potential. It's still confused, so probably gonna. I would I would run that away. I would run that away if I had a uh, if I had one more two more bench Pokemon. I fill up my bench to get rid of that. Actually, I think Necrozma Necrozma might have something to say about that in the next move. So, all right, we're doing okay. We uh we do uh it does have one shot potential on me. I think it may show up pretty darn soon, in which case we'll try to use Necrozma to, you know, bring bring down the Lele, bring down the Weaken Up the Curlia. Yeah, we don't have any retreats at the moment, so two energies up is completely safe. What's going on, buddy? Hey, big boss! What's up? Thank you for joining my channel. Yeah, Zoroark needs draw supports ASAP. It does. But this is the first time, so I'll, you know, I'll make adjustments to see how this goes. So far, I think I've pulled too many Acerolas, or they're just not as, uh, they're just not as fluid. Even though I do want, they have, Zoroark has a great combo with Acerola. Very, very good combo. Like, if I'm, I would definitely want to Acerola right now, so. Alright, Gardevoir is now up. Now, if, 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 if he decides to attack me with this, he may KO himself. It's clear-headed. Oh, this is where you want to use Acerola. So, this is where I retreat. Alright. This is where I want to attack with this card next. I'm gonna end, this is gonna help you out, but I need more basic Pokemons. Yeah, of course you do need basic Pokemons, and that totally counts. That totally, totally counts. We don't need another Necrozma. We don't have any other source of retreat. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the Zoroark in here. And now after this, let's go ahead and use trade. I trade up my Necrozma. I said I don't need it. I really don't need it. You gotta give me a float stone, buddy? No. No, I don't want to. All right, this is gonna be an expensive retreat because we don't have. Oh, I guess it should get some more float stones in here. Here we go, expensive retreat, Necros. Why don't you come out right now? And you're gonna have to pay up for one of these, unfortunately. And we're gonna go and use Black Ray GX. Black Ray, knock out that Lele and soften up the God Award for the future turn. So that means I might be able to get a KO with this. Yeah, I just did 200 damage worth of damage. Oh, there we go, Acerola. Acerola is coming out to get me. Yeah, Big Boss, I was watching YouTube videos. I wonder if you'd be streaming for a release of this. Yeah, I am. I totally am. And got him getting another Gardevoir out. All right, I'm at full, near full power. Near full power. And, all right, I have a lot of cards in my hand. I was gonna, I was gonna, well, you, she'll be able to come back after this. So I think, believe even with resistance, I have enough damage. <laughs> that was a little too late for that, Bridget. And after this, okay, it's starting to, it's, everything's starting to click at this point. Because now that we have more Pokemons out, it's going good. <laughs> Rich, really? Yeah, you know your Gardevoir is going. He, the Gardevoir is going down. There's no other Pokemon to come back with. I have all the Pokemon in the world to fight. Well, you you overcame the Gardevoir. It just had 
you know, the standard non setup deal. So, hey, the crossbow is like, no, this is my video. I did 310 damage. I only thought you did only 200 damage, but, uh, yeah. I think there's something buggy with the system here, but go ahead. Good job for you, Necrozma. GG. All right. Welcome to another Zorhart GX break match. I don't think that's, that actually exists. I'm going to play my remix of Treat You Better from... From Sean Mendes. Bye, Sean Mendes. It's not an anime doll. So, here we go. Let's start off with filling up our bench with Lele's. Uh, uh, yeah, no, with Bridget. Sorry, Bridget, Bridget, here we go. Bridget, go ahead and send you out right there. You can be the Zor Arctas. Let's see, I do want a Necrozma. I do want Zorua. And I probably will pull Ratatata sometime, so let's go ahead and throw you down. And if, if you want to take away my, uh, Float Stone, be my guest. It's gonna be on Necrozma. There we go. That's, uh, yeah, it's kind of like bait. There you go, take it off me, even though I have plenty of items. Plenty, plenty, and plenty of items. Greetings from Florida. Hello, Chinso. Gotta go. Can't wait for Z Venusaur tomorrow. No problem. Hello, Florida. Hope you guys are doing okay in Florida. Here's there's another hurricane coming to New Orleans. Man, our hurricanes are hitting everywhere. Florida got hit. Texas got hit. I got hit. And uh, New Orleans is next. Ooh. Okay, gotta get some water. What are you playing? I saw he, he did destroy a tool removal. It's like it's a float stone. I don't care. Now that I'm benches up, it's pretty good. And I can mallow, I can mallow everything I need next turn. I kinda like that. I kinda like mallow. I really like that. We'll say that. I really like that. Ooh. Now I'm gonna definitely get a DCE and, and probably in the last final bench space Pokemon. Or I can get two Zoroarks and then we could just go all train all day and do stuff. Alright, so that's. I'm gonna add another Mallow. Well, with this setup, I wanna add another Mallow. Can you show the deck list? I, I will, eventually. It'll definitely be on the YouTube channel afterwards. Or I could get you after this. Bridget! Alright, Bridget. Bridget, you're sawing off with Bridget too. The Alolan Vulpix. Is this Metagross? Is this Metagross? No, it is Tapu Koko, and this is just straight Alolan Vulpix. Okay. So, Beacon, any two cards you want. Could be uh, something that counters GX. I do have a counter against the anti-GX one, so I may just pull that up. Actually, I have counters against everything. Except, no, I, have, I can counter everything in this deck. You cannot use any immunity advantage against me. Everything is I. I have it. I have it! So, Volpix, you can get any two cards you want. I, I don't believe... Hey, man, this is gonna give me everything I want. Hi, Mallow! You may be actually good now with the new Zor arcs. This is my first time watching you live! Hi, J-Man. Thank you. Oh, no. Thank you for thank you for catching me. Tapu Finny. You want Tapu Finny? My GX is really, uh... Well, we'll see. My Pokemon is really easy to set up. Mallow. Mallow, what two cards do you want to place at the top of the deck? Of course, it's going to be a DCE. DCE. And if he... I did not see... I did not see the baby Ninetales, but it may just show up. It may. So I will evolve. I will evolve this just to launch it out into oblivion quickly if I uh, if I want to. Or I could pull double Zora Arc. Ah, let's get through that. All right. So Zora Arc, use your trade. I trade up my four Shanas for uh, for the, everything I need. There we go. Zora Arc is ready to come out. Okay, and we'll just do that. We will use Riders beating. Boom. 100 damage, two shot KOs. All right. And we got another Zorark. Unfortunately, I cannot involve you. So uh, we'll, have to, uh, we'll have to put a rain check on you for that. Dalton, are you doing all Shining Legend GX card? Yes, I'm still on the first one. We're spending, uh, we only have four, so we can spend a lot of time at least on the, uh, on the, at least the one the really good ones. So this is the really best one right here. Gotta start off strong. Gotta start off strong. Hello, Zappu Coco. You won't survive one shot for me, but you do have a free retreat, and he may uh, he may decide to use a GX to that. All right, so you have two GX Pokemon. That's good, but unfortunately, this isn't ready to go yet. Okay, so Tapu Finny, hey, you want to use your GX on me? I don't mind at all. I absolutely don't mind at all. <laughs> and oh yeah, my hand. I was gonna play Sycamore myself, so uh, yeah, you play an energy that that helps me out. That helps me out. Another Zora arc, perfect, 
Perfect. You definitely can take my last bench space. And now I can bring back any victim I want to take uh, to, to hit him with. And I likely ah uh, the GX counts is getting very high. Necrozma, why don't you come up there and uh he might be the next card to charge up. Yeah, yeah. It's a weekend, so stay up late and watch the stream. Sure, sure. I appreciate that. Yeah. I'll be up. Uh, I'll be up for quite the night. Ah, uh, Lola Nine Tails. You want to go up? Come up next. Sure, sure. You gotta open it with your GX then. All right. What shall we do? You know, we could just take a KO. I'll, I'll just take the KO. I could use them if I really want something back there. If I really, really want something back there. But I don't think so. I could try to deal with this immediately. I don't know. I, am I more afraid of the Lele or the Tapu Fini? I, I know he is going to definitely GX me. And I want to win the win it as fast as possible. But this is a free prize card. You don't have to work at all for this. And that may be a good thing. There's no way this can get you one shot me. Zero. Zero chance. Abyssal hand. All right, Zora Ark, you're the, my new chef. I, I didn't get you a nickname. Because you are pretty much in line with Co Banana Master. You call me Banana Master? I'm Sushi Master. This is Coconut Master. And you can put Banana Master in your deck. So, oh, no, Banana Master might get replaced. You're gonna give me a Tapu Fini instead? Sure! Sure, 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 sure. So this has a... Okay. Load you up. Give you a choice, man. Uh, not that you need it, but... Uh, do we wanna... I like my cards. You wanna trade, Donald? Uh, okay. Not really, not really. Uh, I guess I could. Here we go, trade. I, uh, I sacrifice. I'm wait. I'm, I want my Guzma, so I'll, let's go ahead and trade an Ultra Ball away. Ultra Ball, what can you get for me? Floatstone. Cool. Okay, now's the time for. Uh, let's go ahead and use Raiju's meeting. 150. Necrozma may finish you off in a bit, so we just, uh, we just Guzma out. Uh, probably Lele because I, I'm just gonna hit by the GX. I'm just gonna get countered. I am just gonna get countered. So, Ultra Ball, discarding a lot of water energies. Two water energies, not a lot. It's a maximum. Nine Tails! Don't worry, I have something to one hit you. I have something, definitely something to one hit that. You wanna come play with me? Sure, sure, sure! Here we go, that's the counter. This is the counter too. There's nothing you cannot use immunities against me. I have everything, all bases covered just by accident. Just by accident. You have immunity to GX Pokemons? They got it. You got immunity to evolve Pokemons? She's got it. You got immunity to basic. Oh, uh, they got it. I'm. A, you gotta play it straightforward, man. No immunity tricks against me. I'm all covered. I am completely all covered. Now, all right, Tapu Fini, I'll find you. Oh, so, oh, you're waiting for me? Sure, sure. Da da. Um, I, I can take it. I can afford to take it slower now. Field blower. Yes, this is time to field blower. Okay, you can take that. You can take him off. Don't need it right now. And yeah, max potion. Oh, you messed me up. Oh man, aqua patch. Uh oh. Oh, do you have a free retreat on you? I don't think so. So I get the free hit on you again. All right. Now, you know, if you send out that card, I will just hit you one shot. So I don't know if you want uh, or we can just worry about that later and do something else. I could Guzma that out and just blast this one shot. Yeah, it's totally possible. Why don't we just do that? You thought you think that can uh, work against me? I don't think so. I don't think so. Here we go. We just send you out right there. I have the counter. Here you are. You can have a DCE right now. And we are just going to use Mind Jack. I don't need any card pulls. I don't need to use my abilities. Actually, I could have thrown away the nest ball. That's something worth uh, tossing away. So, oh, you cannot use immunity tricks against me. Charge up something else. That's yeah, yeah. I can fight me straightforward. Straightforward. All right, Capo Coco comes out, and man, they only yeah, so arcs. They just need a DC, and they are just kick butt. They just kick butt. Calamari Demasi. Jix the Crossma. I could. I could have. But I was like, uh, uh, you want to attack me? Now he, now I'm lowering his ways to deal damage. I'm lowering his ways to deal damage. He's gonna recycle all that back up there. No, you should be charging up something with firepower. You have to fight me head on. You gotta get me head on. I'll put another Mallow in after this, okay? I think I like Mallow. 
Alright, this got DCE, it's ready to fight. There's no way I can one-shot that. Actually, now it's ready to one-shot me. Okay, so uh, Anna's gonna be able to use his GX attack. So this is where I really just want to use Necrozma to fight. I really, really want to use Necrozma, okay. So I can uh, try to try to get something good going, so... Yeah, would, it, once this KO'd, I will send the Rattata out as a free retreat. Always as a free retreat. And we'll just leave it be. Alright, it's like, I'm ready! And it's gonna pay you quite a price to get one prize card, so he's catching up! Yeah, keep momentum and you'll be on your way to victory! So actually, Rattata could fight too. I wouldn't mind Rattata weakening this up. He's gonna GX the Rattata after this if he does, if I do get it out. Alright, put this on you. Play this on you. I'd rather get a choice fan, but I don't know if I'll get it. I'll have to. I guess I'm forced to play regular energies. I don't want to waste anything at all. Sycamore. Now let's go ahead and free up your. Ah. Uh, uh, nobody can attack. Nobody can attack. I, I guess I should have played this on him. No, I have a trick. I have a trick next turn. You can fight. You. I don't know. If I, you know. You can evolve too. You can evolve. I guess I'm going to use you eventually. Alright, so we are gonna use... Do we want to use our trade ability? I don't think so. I have everything I want right now, so let's... Uh, you want thin your deck out? No, I have everything I want. I'm gonna go ahead and use Righteous Beating. Which now, you have to use your GX. There's no way you can one-shot me. I think you're gonna do that. And I'll be ready to come back after this. So he's like, I need a plan B. It's gonna be another one of these? Sure, sure. I already have... Now, uh... <laughs> Play Mew GX, please. I'll play all of them. I think it's time to move on to Zorak after this for sure, though. Yeah, yeah. Nice to see that you're putting a Zorak GX to good use. Who won? It's the best card and best GX in the expansion. Hands down. Hands down is the best. We might, might even show up in all the remaining decks. All my remaining decks after this, too. But, uh... You know, draw's okay. It's okay. I'm just... Pleasant that I have everything I need right now. Floatstone, you want to go back right now? I'm gonna GX you! You gotta fight with everything! You have to GX this turn! You have to GX! Don't do that! No! No, 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 no. Oh. No, don't do that. You cannot cheat me like that. You cannot cheat me like that. You have to GX. You had to GX me. Alright, well, you know, okay. Right. Here we go. I will punish you for that. Here we go. Get back that Acerola. Necrozma, you go up there. And hey, Zorark is back in action. I had the DC in my hand. Okay, I'll take a little bit of damage for that. And now, actually, he will, he might actually have a lethal. No, he's at, he's at the float stone. So, we are going to use Black Ray GX. Finish off that Nine Tails. And all those GX, they are now vulnerable to a one shot. They are now vulnerable. Ends. I'm, I'm, yeah, okay, ends. There we go. And that's two more prize cards. We just got to Guzma, Guzma the last couple cards out. And we're good. We are good. Hey, uh, Era, when are you gonna do the Yamega with the? Uh, 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 oh yeah, SL SL Marshadow. Uh, that, that's a good combo. I'm not sure when. We'll have to put a brain check on that for a while because right now I gotta focus on the, the biggest GX, uh, good GX cards. So, Nine Tails coming back, and I I have the solution here, right here. I just need a poker tool, and then we're good. Or I can just confuse it. I can just confuse it, and we're we're good too. Well, I just need a really need a poker tool. Or I prefer, I prefer if I just get a Guzma. Yeah, Guzma is like, oh, don't worry, well, Guzma's got you. Two of you, uh, two of them are right here in the back of my deck right now. So die tails, Necrozma's. Ne you don't want to hurt me? Okay. Victory. Yeah, yeah. I'm so close to victory. He doesn't really have a good fire. Yeah, he, he kind of knows. He kind of knows. Okay. I did have Guzma in my hand. It would probably take me two more turns. Like the turn after that and the turn after to get me going. So, alright. MVP Zorar. Very easy a deck to do. Very, very easy a deck to do. Uh, we'll see what we in the future. But that's enough for Zorar today. Alright. Welcome to another Zorar GX match. I am going to play my remix of Yumio Graffiti from... Fairy tale, fairy tale. My morning, morning's going pretty great, even though it's my morning. My morning is your night. All right, so hello, user on Exotic. Hi, Alex. Welcome back. 
Thank you for joining me for the stream. Now, Espeon's like, I'm gonna go home now. Po Town, oh yeah, that's definitely gonna sting. That's definitely gonna sting. Drampa, I think I know what you are. I know what you are. I think I might be the one who's getting one shot at this time. So, follow up with the end, right? Or why don't you discard your Sycamores? Why'd you discard Sycamore? Oh, maybe you did play Sycamore. Alright, that's Zoro. Well, you know, I may be able to confuse it, mess it up. Here we go, let's go ahead and do that. Moonlight Confusion. We, uh, we, uh, we, we, uh, we're at a bad, uh, we are at a bad, uh, we got a bad start this time without any, uh, supporters. So, let's just go ahead and confuse you, you know, protect myself from a lethal damage attack. So I was like, hey, you, he swapped too early. He's kind of swapped too early. Look at all those GX Pokemons. Necrozma's like, yeah, let me go get him at him. Let me at him. And now all the super uh, special charges that you want later in the end are at the front. So, yikes. Yikes. Oh, actually, we had a pretty nice, we had pretty easy for the couple. So, still, still. Hey, Donald, we're going to play... I'm gonna be testing deck, so go easy on me. I'll be using the deck that you see on stream, so yeah, uh, you have that. Uh, I guess you have the advantage. You'll be able to pick whatever. So, all right. So, uh, please, Pokemon. You gotta get me a draw. Ah, this is looking bad for me, man. Look at all these Zora arcs here. I don't want to sick of because I don't want to shuffle all these back up. Big Wheel GX. He's like, no, I'm not gonna attack. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Wow, so many cards. I want some card pulls too. I want some card pulls too. Oh, that's a little late. Uh, you know, I could uh, start attacking this, actually. Let's go ahead and put this up right now. I don't. I could attack him. I could blast him right now, but I'd rather save it for a different. Uh, you know, hit us all GXs and be better off with that. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this. This will hurt me, unfortunately, and bring me. If he does attack me, I'm gone. But brick free turns. No, Donald, you're not getting an Ultra Ball. Not getting a light height. You're not getting any of your draw supporters. He's now shut down all abilities. No, not yet, not yet. He still has to play an item. So all abilities are now shut down. It's like, ha ha, you draw Lele. You will still be stuck. Ha ha ha. And this does not the Zorark we want. And he's like, oh, I am freed. I am freed. Yes. Free me. Free me from this uh, nightmare. And now he's got a weakened bench Pokemon. So that Zorark is going to hit pretty bad, hard. Pretty hard. Yeah, that's what I meant to say. And the Krasma, and the Krasma, yeah. We cannot play any abilities, okay, Donald? Abilities are currently shut down. He can't play any, you can't play any, unless you do something about it soon. So, wow, that's a full bench. Hey, Zorark, go ahead and fight with this. Ooh, did not missing a DCE, choice ban. All right, Righteous Edge. It hits, it is clear headed. Oh man, we have a big, we got a choice ban, we can get this. Oh man, I don't want to waste these these right here, but I have to. I want to get my attack. Definitely want to get an attack in with this. Why well, don't I could just retreat, right? And I could play this instead. You know, this is opportunity. We're not gonna waste any opportunities. We are gonna destroy some Zora arcs, but we can get them back. So we need to sell up our bench right now because that's a little late. To the, we're very late to the party. I think this is a lethal hit. Yeah, this is a lethal hit. I could shut down with abilities, but uh, you know, I lock my hand. Wow, all the DCs up here. Here we go, mind check. You fill up your bench, I will take the first two prize score. But I am poorly set up uh, right now. Poorly, poorly. There's the Krasma. Oh man, I don't need, really need that. So whatever comes out should, should easily defeat me. Oh yeah. The evolution. No, 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 this is just you for the free retreat. So, yeah, <laughs> yeah. If you, if you fill up your bench again, I will one shot you again. Yeah, I actually don't have a choice, man. So, uh, you know, rain check on that, rain check, rain check, okay. Alright, Lele is like, I can finish this off. Yeah, this is the next card coming out of the fight, though. Alright, so you take one prize card, I'm ready to go, but why do I have to spend the DCs to attack? Where can't you just give me regular energies, Pokemon? I'd like regular ones, please. Alright, uh, nobody has a free, oh, you know, I would fight with you, but I don't want to be spending all my DCs, man. I want to be spending my regular stuff. Bum. How do I want to play this? How do I want to play this? 
This is going to be the last DCs of my decks until I play my special charge. I want to open it with a Sycamore, likely. We'll have to play it this way. This is such a weird... I need more... Oh yeah, I forgot to remove abilities. I forgot to do that. I forgot to take that off, which I meant to do. Alright, we can... Uh, we can. Uh, that, that, that's a waste. That's a misfire. Let's go ahead and remove your float stone. I guess I could remove your stadium, too. Town. No, no, if this thing goes into combat, then it will one-shot me, and it's almost ready to go, so I'm gonna remove those two right there. I could, uh, open up with, uh, you know what, let's open up with a Lele right now. Let's go ahead and take, throw these guys off the bus. Alright, no more, no more, uh, no more of those. Where is that Lele? Lele, there's no more Lele. There's no more Lele. So we'll throw a Zorark in here now, so we can use our abilities. I'm sorry, Lele. Alright. Hurts itself a little bit. Let's go ahead and use Trade. I don't need a Necrozma. Really, I don't need a Necrozma. I just need a draw support. Alright, we definitely want to use the Special Charge after that goes down. Alright, here we go. Black Ray GX. And this cannot be harmed by... Oh yeah, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. So, right now, Lele is the only thing can, that can hurt this. That Krasma will not be able to hit this. So, if you're watching my stream, Lua, oh no, you gotta see something else. Acerola! What? You want the Espeon back? You don't want the Lele. I would've done it with the Lele, but he was like, no, nope, I want Espeon. I want Espeon. Maybe that was a mistake too, because I would've done it with a Lele so I could repeat my Lele and stuff. So, I was like, nope. Like, I mean, you could use the evolution on this, but it doesn't matter too much. La 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 la. All right, man. Our rat, our rat mans don't want to show up to the field. There's Lele. I want the Lele too. Now I'm stuck. Oh, what's with our draws, man? Sycamore's like, I'm not showing up, man. I'm not showing up to the party. Okay, and we got our, our, all our draw supporters at the back of the deck right now. Floatstone, shutting down all abilities once again. Once more, we're uh, we're uh, we're in the quiet zone. So actually, I think this might actually do more damage, but we'll see. We'll see what what he wants to do. All right, Luona, I'm sure you know what my lights end does. Reminding you, if you do retreat and hit me with the Drampa, it would be silly. It would be very very silly. And we do uh, abilities shut down, meaning I cannot use to trade. However, I guess this is the strongest card out right now. You're only using two Leles. Yep, I'm a cheap jerk. I'm cheap. And I think all my draw supporters are prized up. Energy Drive! There we go. Good man. You're listening in. You know it. Alright, Trump has a lethal damage on me if he uh, comes out. I can do 90 damage and finish this off. I think that might be the right move. I don't want to give you a prize card for sure, and nor do I want to keep that energy on me. I think he forgot to, uh, let's see, retreat. I'd only do 80 damage. No, I could finish, I could... Doesn't matter, really matter which card I choose. Okay, let's put that down in there. Yeah, you can have this. It's time to play Special Charge. So let's go ahead and get Special Charge. Get those maximum value, energy values up. We'll have to wait, bait it off breath. Bait off breath for the next card. So this should do... 80 damage. That's that's enough. I am doing 80 damage to you. Boom! Alright, and you do have a DC, so Righteous Edge could remove uh, my energy. So there we go, N. Wow, I do not need an N at the end of the game. Not at the end of the game, man, buddy. But, hey, it could get me something. It can get me something. Yeah, Eradicate. Oh, thank you for the N. Well, actually, sure. Thank you for the N. Give me Sycamore and Shana. That, I know they're in my deck. Oh, oh. Oh, okay, so we may, uh, you know, we just need to hit this Drampa to finish the game off. How many Guzmas we have? We're so close. Yet so far. Yet so far. I would I would send the Drampa out. Yeah, but he's like, he might draw a DC and then that could end the game for me for him. <laughs> Drew really wants me to get hook me hooked on Taco Bell. Here's another $5 for the big box. I guess we will be going to visiting Pokeball Taco Bell very often. Thank you, Drew. Thank you, thank you. So, 
Okay. Uh, there's gonna be some talk more of Taco Bells in my vlogs. <laughs> I might want to take a break for that, but thank you, Drew. Thank you very much for the donation. Thank you. Yes. Thanks, man. Okay. Okay. So now we do get Shauna. I am definitely gonna Shauna because I want to finish this. No, this is a healthy one. This is a fresh and healthy one. All right. Don't have an energy. I may have to leave that card up to die. Unfortunately, we do have these E's left in our deck. I couldn't do anything with that one single energy. I'd rather trust the back one. How many Zor are break? I think I have one to zero. It might be prized up. It might not be. But unfortunately, yeah, the DC got removed. Otherwise, I would take a blast this. Blast this a bit. So he just needs one more energy. And I, uh, I decided to go with less Sycamores because of... And again? And again? Dang, he really wants to shrink my hand out, man. So... Alright, that's half of what I need. I just need an energy after this. That's kind of what I need. Now, he's going on... There it is. Choice man. Gonna take a prize card. Ow, gonna catch up big time. So, wait, I'm still alive! Ah! Oh, oh, good for you! <sighs> but we don't have anything to come back hit him after this. I'm completely blocked. I'm completely blocked. All the abilities are shut down. I'm just, I'm just waiting for my last draws, guys. I'm just waiting for a good draw. Just give me a good draw. Give me the good cards. Give me the right cards. You can hit me again. I am stuck. I've been stuck all game. I have played uh, one shot on one Sycamore. All the ends. Now the ends are after, coming after me because now if you don't get them at the start, they'll just screw you over. So he's like, oh, I'm st yeah, Righteous Edge again. Finishes him off. And now he's catching up. <sighs> Lame, where are you, Goo? Why can't I set up? Why won't you let me set up, Pokemon? Oh, man. Okay, I'm, I've been unlocked. I have been unlocked. Come on, Top Deck, yeah. So I guess he's telling us, I just that's more than more supporters. I know you have a lot, but. Goose my out, bring out the Lele. Bring out uh, what you want the Lele? You want to two shot my Lele? I think so. You can't two shot my Lele. Why don't you go for the the Krasma? It's almost uh it's almost dead, but he'll just leave it be. He needs a choice band to finish me off. There we go, choice band. And I think that is it. I've just been bricked to death. I am now bricked. I, I'm, I'm bricked. One more prize card. That's game. That is game. I'm gonna Moonlight Madness you because I have nothing else. And that is that. Mm -mm. Alright, Mr. Deck, 26 cards. Guzma, that's that. Retreat. He's like, Phew. you got lucky there, man. Good lucky. I got. Well, not really. Not really. I think they ended that. The end and, and the and the Garbro are locked. So. We gotta. I guess we gotta do something about that. Okay. Moving on, moving on, rest in peace. Wow. You got to the end of my video? Thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. It is time we rate this deck. Zorak, let's break you down. You better give me a good score. We'll see, we'll see. So, unique trait. What makes you special? Like every Zorak in the past, they have always been efficient. They can. This work for one energy, pretty much. And this is a GX, so it's okay. They look very few energies, yet they give you very good value. Yeah, I wish all Pokemon for DC gets two shots. This is one of a kind, so... Everything's just efficient. It makes your deck more efficient, too. Moving on, damage, damage. Damage? No, goes to 120 naturally. Choice span 150, that is a two-shot. Trickster? You may copy something really good. You may get a one shot with that. So, we're gonna give it a four out of five. If you're trying to go for a two shot, sometimes it's a one shot. And that's average. That's where most decks should be. So, four out of five. All right, setup. How's the setup on this deck? You won't got any stage twos. That gives you a good bonus. You, all these Pokemons need either two, 
pretty much a maximum of two energy guards. Most of them one, some of them zero. The setup is going to be a medium of 4.5. Why did I take the 0.5 off? Filling up your bench space can be a little rough at the start. I'm choosing actually to run fewers lately. That could possibly be it. I had more nest balls help me with that though. You know, try to be a little bit budget with that. But overall, it is really fast. It is really fast. It's consistent. We can almost give it out 5 out of 5. But uh, now that's where, that's where you know, you'll, you'll, be, uh, you'll be pressured. How do I do enough for damage with this? Hmm. Okay, so the setup. Four, oh wait, I think did that. 4.5 out of 5. Payoff is also a 4.5. So, payoff usually a 5 out of 5 is you can abuse Max Potion, and this deck can abuse Acerola. It can also abuse one prize card Pokemons that do something significant. Yeah, because that gives you, you know, above the normal prize cards that your opponent has to fight. They have to go for a lot more than just, hey, just Zorhark, Zorhark, Zorhark. Yeah, somebody they have to go for you know, like one or two extra prize cards to beat you. And that's why you, uh, you know, you get the bonus points up there. I should give you a 5 out of 5. I should just give you a 5 out of 5. Rating! Rating! You know why I didn't? Because it doesn't have as high as Metagross or, or, or that. But it still stills up there. Now, rating, I'll give it a 4.5 out of 5. This is an excellent GX. You'll be seeing it a lot more in my decks. So right now it may, may be expensive, but damn, it is worth it. It makes decks really good. So, you know, to make some good decks, I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna try to use it more. So you'll see it next time for Entei for sure. Dex video, right? You? Nah, not so much. Not so much. Oh, we didn't finish that weakness. Weakness. The only real weakness is that you may not fill up your bench. You know, that's where the point five was taken off. And upgrades, which is, you know, we haven't tried. This is the very first video. Try with a lot of other partners, so that's more. That's more to come. You'll be seeing him more. So, thank you. Uh, nope, Raichu is up for next time. Then Entei after that. So now you get the idea. That video. This video is gonna come out 9 a.m. tomorrow. Yeah, I think maybe Entei maybe Monday. Until we already have the video. You might see it early somehow though. Okay, so please like, subscribe, because you know you want to see more GX cards, more Shining Legends content, as well as Crimson Invasion. I will have it all here for you. Follow me on social media. I'll give you clues when new things are happening. If you like these remixes, the next album is coming this uh, next month. I'm going to wrap it all up this month. So, we have one more song to go. And, yeah, they're all on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream your music. You can find my remixes there. And I think that's it. Yeah. Next video, right you, 9 a.m. Thank you very much, Integrals and the Frenchers. You guys have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time for Right You GX. Thank you. Bye-bye.